Hello everybody and good day to you all. Today I am talking about House of Dragon season number one, episode number three, second of his name. In this episode right here, um, we, we're pretty much following, uh, we got a lot of things. We got, uh, it's, pretty much a it's a time skip. Because we got to get the king and he's with his wife now and they have they have, they have a son and they also got a child on the way. And because of this relationship that they have, it's also caused this conflict with his, with his daughter. Because She's seeing her best friend, who she confided in, sleeping with. Not, well, now she's sleeping, being with her dad, and now she has a son by him, and then that son may replace her as the heir. And, and she's just seeing all this stuff. How she, she, now she's pissed off. She's mad. She's mad. Which makes perfect sense. I mean, come on. She she was she was announced to be the heir. And let's say no, he has a son now. It may not possibly another one because he has another son. Now she even pushed even further back, and so that's not going to happen for her. And so now she's trying to figure out what, what, what's my place. What's my purpose? Why am I here? What what am I supposed to do? Should, should I am, I am I the maid? Am I your am I your right hand man? Am I am I your advice? What am I? What am I? I'm just supposed to pour drinks for you the rest of your life. What what's what's going on? What's going on? And so she now she doesn't know what she's supposed to do. So she now she's a little she's a little bit upset. And they also got this whole hunt thing going on there too. It's a, 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 a tradition. And everybody puts the gum and the, the, and the king puts the kill of off the, uh, the white deer. Everybody be looking forward to seeing that. Blah, 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 blah. And then while you got that going on, the family drama there, you got more family going on, on, on with Damon. He take, he's fighting the crab king where he's at. And the crab, even though he has dragons, the crab king somehow managed to way to win. Because the crab king knows the land more. He, he got, um, he's hiding in the tunnels and the caves. And they can't get to him. And they're trying to get him out so they can kill him all off so they can take over the place. But they're having little difficulties there. And the word gets back to it. The, the, the Damon's brother and brother wants, wants to um people help out, but things just don't go according to how things go. Cause it, it was still right here. You're seeing Damon risk it all, almost get himself killed because how much he hates his brother. This whole his whole motivation was was fueled by spite because they came up with a plan and they needed somebody to, to be like sort of like um um. A distraction. Somebody to go out there and be a distraction while they flank them from the sides, and that, that way they can get can kill everybody. And then the guy, the person who will be distracted, may get killed. May get killed. And so Damon volunteered his tribute, and he pretty much went through a whole lot of guys for the plan to come to action. Seeing him in action, cause the first, it, it, it all started off because his brother decided to send men over there, let him know, hey. I see, you, I see you're having trouble. I see, I see things going sideways for you. So how about this? I'm going to send some people over there to help you out. Got some ships coming in. And they're going to help you out. You're going gonna to take this thing over. Because I, I love you, brother. I don't want to see nothing bad thing happen to you. And this, this is like, this is, this is miscommunication to the highest point of view. Because Damon reading this letter, not seeing a brother who loves him, not seeing a brother who wants to support him, help him out. He's seeing a brother who, just want, who wants to tell him, pretty much telling him, you're too weak to do it by yourself. You're, you're not strong enough to handle your business. You went out, you stirred off on your own because you're pissed off because you can't be, you can't be the, the heir. So now you're throwing a tantrum and then now you got, you, you got in some trouble you couldn't handle and then your big brother has to help you out. That's, all, that's what he saw. He said, no, 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 no. I don't need you. I don't want your help. I didn't ask for your help and so you don't give me your help and I'm going to risk my life to prove to you how much I don't need you. And when I win this war, I can spit in your face and let you start saying, See, I told you I don't need your stinking troops. Matter of fact, if they come over here, I'm going to kill them. What you going to do about that? What you going to do about that, big bro? Huh? Huh? And also, you also notice the king has lost some fingers. He is slowly dying. So I don't know, I don't know what, what he's dying of. Is, is it grayscale? Is it, is it tetanus? Whatever, whatever is going on. But he's, he's not having a good day health, as health-wise. But good thing he's having kids now, so... So I guess we're now. I don't know how this is gonna go. Is he gonna actually pick his heir before he go before he dies? Is it, is it gonna be his daughter, which is gonna be kind of weird and throw things out of whack? Is it gonna be his son, which everybody thinks it's gonna go into? And uh, because so far he has, even though he has all these advisors telling him to do, he has not fully had gone the places where they thought they were gonna go. Like they they wanted they wanted him to marry that girl who's part of the other part of the, who, who's now joined Damon. His daughter, which would have made more sense, would have strengthened the houses and put them together. Matter of fact, he would have been on his side, but nope, he went. He went with the, he went with the hands daughter. A little sideways there, but you know. And then, which also his daughter pointed out to him that hey, if you want power, you want a thing to go by tradition, you should have married. You should have married the other girl, but you chose to marry this one. 
So, but then the Obasi also has to touch a touch moment between them as well, even though the, the confidence they have between, between one another, he people say, hey, look, okay, I'm sorry. I messed up. Okay? I know this, you know this, but but this, this is how things are. So how about this? Whoever you feel as though is worthy of you to be married, I'm not going to push you on, I'm not push the money on you anymore. I'm not going to try to pimp you out. I'm not going to do none of that stuff. You, you can choose who you want to be with, and whoever you choose has found me. If they make you happy and you're happy with them, that's fine. Because because even though you want to have your freedom, you want to be in charge, do your own thing, and something like that too, go against the rules and the traditions, even, you can't, we can't. So how about this? You, you let me, Let's compromise, okay? You you find the person you want to be with, whoever they may be, and then if, as long as you're happy, I'm happy, and we can move forward. How about that? That's all I can give you. Because this whole, because the, the one thing that's going to pretty much mess up the Targaryens, it's not the outside, it's not the outside forces, not everybody that means from the outside, it's them. They're going to tear each other apart. Damon is like a wild card, he might just go go nuts. Um, you got the, the king, he's slowly dying at the, at the same time, being bombarded by other people trying to give him advice, saying, you should do this, you should do this, you should do this. His daughter, who he thinks is going to be like his saving grace by listening to him, is also like, Gah! and so he's, he's slowly losing it. Because he seemed like a good guy, really, but he just like, he's surrounded by, he's like, he's stuck in this place where he doesn't want to be at. Like, he just wants to live his life and live in peace and hope everything go well. But that's not how things supposed to go. He got to, even when he, when he when he finally got the deer and, and killed it, you can tell he was like he wasn't his heart, his heart wasn't into it. He didn't even care. It wasn't even the white deer. He was just why am I even here? All, all you can tell he's like he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, like he's, um, he's he's just tired of all this tradition, tired of living by these rules, living, uh, uh, expectations. Everybody wanted to do. He didn't want to get married again. He didn't want to get married again. He his wife died. His son died. He was done. He said, you know what? I don't even want to get married anymore. I don't even want to do this anymore. I just want to, look. I give it to my daughter. She let her have it. Fine. She runs. She runs the show. But because of tradition, people say you need to have. You need got to have an heir. You got to do this. And so he said, this girl was being nice to him. She said, fine. I marry you then. And the next thing you know, now I'm saying you gotta pick your son. You gotta pick your son. You gotta pick your son. You gotta, pick your son. You gotta, you gotta name your son as the heir. You gotta do that. You gotta do this. And his daughter over here. Like this, he, he wants. He, he wants to love his daughter. He wants to talk to his daughter. He wants to tell her how he feels about her. And he actually doesn't believe in her. But at the same time, because this his son, he can't. He gotta go. It's the boy. I'm sorry. If I had two girls, you would have been. The, you wouldn't been up there. But now, no, 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 no. no. And I, I still want you to be on my side. I want you to be with me. And she like this. Well. I would, but you, you screwed me over in a way you kind of did. So I was like, ugh, problems, problems, problems. And even worse, she saw the white deer and he did. So he's like, wow. But a great episode, though. This episode really got me got me into it. The special effects and the CGI, especially when it comes to the dragons, is just beautiful to look at. So at a certain times, the CGI is a little weird. Especially when they, did, like, like, when they, did, when they were doing the crabs, the CGI looks kind of funny. But when they're showing those dragons, showing those dragons in action, like, oh my gosh, it's amazing. Wow. Wow, beautifully shot and how they look and how they're coming down like this. They really, do, they really do look, look real. So, great episode. I'm looking forward to see where this go from here. Um, I, it's, 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 because of what happened with, with the last um, thing with the, uh, Game of Thrones, I'm I, I'm excited for this show. This episode right here got me even more excited. But at the same time, I'm also, I'm also very hesitant as well too because I have no idea where it's going to go from here. It, 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 it can, this could be the peak, and it could just go straight down the hill from here. It could, it, it could just crash and burn all the way down. Because it's why, why again? I fell for it again. But so far, I'm, I'm in. I really enjoyed this episode a whole lot. So leave comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this episode of, of House of the Dragon. If you haven't watched it, check it out for yourself. Hopefully, you watch it. You would enjoy having watching it too. So give my channel a like, hit the thumbs up. Shaboop, and subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate it. Also, uh, so links down below. Connect you on my social media. You want to follow me there? Thank you. Also to my to my store where I sell stuff from, from t-shirts, the socks, the hats, the what's nots. I mean, this is one of my shirts right here. This is my I am my Ninja Rabbit shirt right here. Bing bang boom. And others have others as well. Go on and check it out. See what you like. Buy some stuff. And you do. Thank you. Like I always say in my dreams of life, I am. The Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, people. <laughs>